Hey everyone, Brandon with Galloway Precision. Today we are going to shoot our first rounds of the CZ P07. Now this particular one is the Suppress Ready model, but as many of you may have noticed, we've started producing more and more things uh, for CZs, and next on the list is the P07, especially this particular model, as we are going to make a comp for it. Uh, we've gone ahead and got rid of the safety and turned it into the decocker model because that's what CZs excel at anyway. Uh, and of course, spring kits and things like that we'll look at, but being a CZ fan, I expect to like this pistol a lot. So, without any further ado, let's get to shooting. So we'll be testing with PMC Bronze 115, locked and ready to rock. We'll start from the decock. And CZ accuracy. <laughs> well, except for my one little flyer there, we've pretty much stayed center mass, just the way I like it. Uh, this is also the model that has the 15 round mag with the plus two extension for Metgar on it. <coughs> so, all in all, pretty much what I expected. Um, CZs are known for their accuracy and reliability. That's what they do. So let's load up some more and uh, let's shoot some steel. All right, loaded back up, let's shoot some steel. Woo! <laughs> Oh, I wish I'd have been shooting in slow mo. <coughs> I forgot to mention that's part of my uh, Yankee Thunder DIY kit. Thirty six bucks, man. Uh, the uh, hangers and the legs to make the feed. I need to go get conduit so I can actually build the rest of the target stand. Um, but I had some pipe laying around, wanted to uh, hang the bowling pin from chain. So I've used all the hangers uh, that come in the kit, so I'm going to have to order some more, but that was pretty wicked. Let's see if we can do that again. That was funny. Spinning. So, of course, I love it. Everything about it. Uh, the outside of the CZ P10C, this is one of the uh, polymer CC CZs I wanted forever. This is Eric. So, we accidentally ordered it for somebody <coughs> who wanted the P10C version of this, and. Uh, so it just happened well well we got it let's make parts so uh one of the things obviously i said compensator uh we'll probably do a guide rod at some point um spring kit possibly but quite honestly cz's already have a really nice double single uh so we may just do a trigger with pre and post travel stops instead so let's load up another mag and do some more uh spinning of targets up there Here's somebody else. As soon as I came out here and started videoing earlier, they decided they wanted to compete. Which is funny. I've been out here videoing for about an hour or two. We put 80 to 100 grams to the reach gun. On gun number three of the day. So it's always entertaining when them boys up in the holler. Earlier, I'm trying to get him to do it again. I don't know who it is. But earlier, I got him to actually talk guns, do talking guns with me. 
pretty sweet. So, anyhow, all right, now let's see how she does with the mag of garbage. Tula 115. Swinging so much. There we go. All 17 rounds. Not surprising because, well, it's a combat pistol. All right. So let's load up. Uh, it's getting really cold. So uh, I'd say so far, though, with the CZ, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10, like always. Um, my big thing is I do get pinched on the recoil right there because of uh where my hand is so if it recoils just right and i've got my skin in there and i've got a tight grip like i always do i'm squeezing the shit out of it that will pinch me but that's a minor minor complaint um and easily solved really uh just quit sticking my pinky there <coughs> and that would probably help and quit grabbing my hand like it's gonna fall off but let's load up our uh let's load up one or two more mags and keep on the fun we need to find up uh i got mojo riot targets coming in but if you guys got some craziness you want to send me to see in a video dude i'll hang it up on my yankee thunder targets i'll hang it up wherever so if you got some craziness you want to see just let me know all right from the decock. Let's do it. This is really hard to do. Oh, wow. All right. So, first malfunction at all because of my grip. Ejected correctly, just didn't load all the way because I let loose of the, my support hand when I shouldn't have. I know better. But my hands are getting too cold to feel anything. So, I think that's going to be the last mag. Uh, so pain in the ass about uh, cold weather injuries so we'll flip the camera back around do my ugly mug one last time and we'll get on out of here what do you say so i was gonna wrap this one up guys uh czp07 like i said nine out of ten my only complaint i have with this gun is it does pinch crap out of me right there so we'll probably look at uh doing an extension that closes that gap completely if we can and then uh comp guide rod trigger some other fun little stuff but that's gonna wrap it up guys got any questions feel free to email me at tech that's tango echo charlie hotel at gallowayprecision.com be sure to follow us here on social media on youtube like comment subscribe below follow us on firearms friendly full 30 gun streamer facebook instagram and vimeo and as always, be safe, be accurate, and God bless.